in today's video, I'm going to show you guys what I got in my BoxyCharm this month. It's not an unboxing because I did use the products already. They're the products I used today, so my eyes, my lips, highlighter. You guys will see. You guys will see everything. Um, so I'm basically going to give you guys a little review on what I thought about the product. So I'm going to be switching it up. Sometimes I'll be doing like little makeup tutorials. Sometimes I'll just be unboxing them. Sometimes I'll use them before the video and show you guys like what I liked about them and what I didn't, you know. So I hope you guys enjoy like these videos. I try to make it different for you so it won't be the same thing every single month. Let's hurry up because my camera is now dying. Perfect. So the theme this month was Downtown Charm. So this is a little card it comes with every single month. Here are the products you got in the box and it tells you a little bit about each product and how much they usually are and stuff like that. So if you guys don't know, this box is $21 a month. I get a lot of questions on that. It is only $21. It's a subscription box. You can cancel at any time. And honestly, guys, honestly, I've been working with BoxyCharm for so many months and if I did not like it, I would not keep telling you guys about it. I would not come back every single month with another video. I truly love BoxyCharm, and half of the products I use on a daily basis is from BoxyCharm. Uh, it saves you so much money, and the products are so, so good. So let's get started because I don't want my camera to die. So the very first thing on here is the eyeshadow palette by Real Her. So you either get a palette 1, 2, or 3. I got number 3 which is in there was a name for it okay so this is the I feel beautiful palette okay so these retail for $28 on their own so just this product here is more than the box um, so I did use this it does come with a mirror which is a good thing because I love palettes that come with mirrors just in case you want to travel with them here's what the palette looks like so it comes with nine shades overall um, it's a little one. You, this is very easy to travel with. So overall, let me tell you guys about this. I did use it on my eyes. It looks pretty. I really like how the look ended up coming out. They had a lot of fallout, but I do want to say they blended out very, very well. Money said up that there. I do want to say they blended out very well. I like the way they blended out, but I did not like how much fallout they had. So they're not as pigmented as I expected, but I do like the overall look that I got from it. Like I said, they blended out very well. Just the fallout and the pigment was not so, so great. So I have mixed emotions about that palette. It's okay. So this is a brush that I got in the palette. It's just a long tapered brush. A tapered highlight slash blending brush. And this is by the brand Aesthetica. I hope I said that right. And this is the H22 brush. 22, H22 brush. And this retails for $21. So you could use this. It said to highlight or to wipe away like under eye powder or if you baked you know any loose powder that you get on your face guys this brush was amazing i loved this brush i used it to wipe away my loose powder under my eyes and kind of to bake under my contour very very good brush i love just how flexible it is it's so soft you do not want a harsh brush or a hard harsh brush to wipe away under your eyes or anything like that you want a soft um very flexible brush and this was perfect this is my new go-to brush for that it's so amazing. I also used it a little bit to highlight with the matte colors, not my not my um, glowy highlight. With the matte colors, I used to highlight like on my nose and on my forehead, you know. So, very, very good brush. The next thing I'm going to talk about is the lipstick I'm wearing. So, this is the Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick. And this is in the color, it doesn't have it on the packaging but it did come with a little card and this is in the color Tuscany uh, don't mind the door Maricela's coming in and out um, but from the card I was expecting it to be like a gray deep 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 purple gray color and I was not that excited about it honestly I was like I don't think I'm ever gonna wear that there she goes there she goes but it actually turned out to be a very pretty pinky purpley mauvey color and I totally totally love it I just really like them and I love the formula and I really liked this color so thumbs up for that so the next thing that I actually have not tried these are the only things that I did not try these are three sheet masks by Bio Bell Cosmetics and these retail for $14.97. Oh, by the way, the lipstick retails for $19.90. 
So these are three sheet masks. I'm excited to try these. One is for hydrating and nourishing your skin. This other one is to diminish the appearance of fine lines. By the way, the packaging is so adorable. Like, so cute. And the last one is a primer mask. So this preps the skin for a flawless makeup application. Don't mind my nail missing. <laughs> Um, so I'm so, so excited to try these. And the last product is this Artist Couture Diamond Glow Powder. And I did get the color Conceited. I was a little bit scared when I looked at this color because I had never heard of it. I had heard of other amazing Artist Couture highlighters. Um, but I hadn't heard of this one. So I was like, uh-oh, what if it's not that popular? What if a lot of people don't use it? What if it's, like, not that great? Sorry about my bra strap. Let's ignore that, okay? <laughs> But I actually ended up loving it. If you have not heard of Artist Couture, I have heard so much about it. Um, especially about these. I don't know if they have other products, but about their loose. What are these called? Loose Glow Powder. So that basically this is a loose powder, a highlighter. Um, like I said, heard so much about them. I've heard they're amazing. And they are. Obviously, by looking at this highlight, you can tell... I loved this highlight. I love highlighters that pop. I love a really, really bright highlighter, and this definitely did the job. The packaging is also so cute. I hope you can see this. I like the packaging because you can, it has a little plastic thing that you can twist. So once you twist it, you can see the little holes for the powder to come out. And if you don't, if you're like traveling with it and you don't want it to get all over the place, which loose powders can get very, very messy. You just turn it back around and the plastic is over the holes so the powder does not spill or anything. So I really like that also about this but obviously I love the highlighter itself. Turned it out very very nice and very bright. So that retails for $26.99 so that is a little bit pricey. Um, I can totally see why and it comes with a good amount as well. And the color is so pretty. I didn't talk about the color. It's like a rose. I want to say it's a rose gold but with a lot more gold. It just has a tint of like rose and pink to it. I just loved it. I really liked this highlighter. So this box was a huge thumbs up for me. I didn't hate this palette. It just wasn't one of my favorites but everything else was so so amazing guys. I definitely recommend especially this highlighter. The highlighter is bomb and it's $27. So obviously it's better to get the box which is $21 because you get so many other things. Then if you were to buy the highlighter on its own, it's $27 and you only get the highlighter, you know. So definitely recommend to go get this box. The link will be in the description box as always so you guys can go get it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any more ideas for the next box of charm, feel free to let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.